Hey John here again. So I got kind of an interesting one here. So uh, I got this uh, Proform trainer treadmill thing I bought years ago for the wife, and uh, it's always worked good. But so it just recently stopped working, and uh, so I'm like, okay, let me go see what's going on. So the symptoms were this: this uh, this was relocated. I'm in the middle of uh, putting in a, a closet down here so I moved everything but I think it's just a coincidence I don't think it has anything to do with it because she uses it but it, not very often so anyways she says that just number two number eight and uh, the stop button that was the only thing that was working so I came down here and sure enough two and eight and stop you couldn't incline you couldn't speed it up you couldn't do nothing none of the workouts work none, none of the buttons work except two eight and stop and you know of course I mess with the uh, the button here you know because that uh, still plugged in so um, so nothing was working trust me no matter how hard you push on this or lightly touch it didn't matter none of the buttons to eight and stop is the only thing that works so I'm like well let me uh, let me take this uh, you know backside apart maybe something dusty in there so uh, crap it's very dark in here um, what the heck's my light well I don't have my light you just have to take my word for it I uh, I took Took some stuff off and, uh, you know, didn't find very much as far as dust or anything. So, this is the display here. It's, everything's just hanging. It's plugged in so I can't really uh, disturb it too much. So, I didn't really find anything. I don't know what I was looking for. Maybe, a, I don't know, see the top of a capacitor busted or something. But, this ribbon looked fine and that's where the inputs come from. So, nothing was really out of the ordinary. So then I took the bottom cover off and uh, holy bananas. That thing had so much, uh, I think I got a picture of it. Uh, so much dust, uh, what dog hair, dust, and you know this thing's years old. So, I mean, you could barely make out these components, and I'm thinking, well, that's got to be it. So I blew everything out, and sure enough, come back up here, nothing. Two, eight, and stop. So I'm like, well, you can't just get this display. It doesn't come apart, you know, from underneath here. I, I don't, I don't know where the hell my light went. Let me get my light on a second. So, as you can see from the bottom there. That's all molded plastic. There's no way it comes apart. You can't get to the underside. You see where that ribbon sneaks in? There's no way to get it undone. So I'm like, well, man, I got to buy a whole new top piece here, I guess. You know, does it come with all these motherboards and all this crap? And is it really worth the money? How much is it going to be? Blah, blah, blah. Maybe we just buy another one. So then I thought, well, it's toast anyway. Let me try something. So this is what I did. And this ultimately fixed it. And I can explain how or why. Get this light down. Oh, yeah. So I got a knife under here and I peeled this sticker off, right? I just put it back on, but get it off here again. There we go. So it's off and now magically everything works. Can't explain it, but um see this is start. So you just hit start. No problem. Treadmill starts moving. You can hit any button. Which one's this is incline? No problem. Of course, stop always worked before, but uh, can't explain it. That's what I did to fix this. And then I thought, well, I'm just going to put some labels, you know, corresponding labels with my label maker, and everything's good, right? Then I thought, well, let me try putting this back on. You know, of course, the, this is the third time it'll be on, but um, it kind of sticks because it's still got some glue. Ugh, I'm trying to do this one-handed. Anyways, I'll probably take this off. Yeah, see, it's still sticky. Well, you have to take my word for it. It suddenly, suddenly works. I have to miss the line. I'll have to do this uh, with two hands, but... Now when you hit things, it works. Magically. Stop, speed, everything works. Slow it down, hit a number, six, speeds up. <laughs> so, so, you're just gonna have to trust me, none of the buttons worked, I don't know why. If you have this problem, before you go taking everything apart and going all nuts with it, get a little X-Acto knife under here. Peel this sucker back gingerly, of course, and uh, 
see if the buttons work. I can't explain it, but it's an easy fix. Well, it took me a little time, but I did have to blow that out anyways. It was just so gunked up. I'll put a picture, I'll show you that. But, so now i got to put everything back together. Mrs. is going to be happy because uh, we don't have to get another treadmill. And uh, it works again. And if, if this, you know, I don't know if air got under it or, you know, dust couldn't get under it. It's a sticker. I, again, I can't explain it, but that's what I did to fix it. Anyways, thanks for watching.